You're watching Seatome TV. Knowledge is power. So typically ALKs occur in something called fusions, as you mentioned. The ALK gene um, is a gene that is turned off. And so it's important to note here that ALK, ALK uh, is a gene that is only active in the embryonic state. In other words, this gene is, is used to develop the early humans in the embryonic state. And then once they grow up and become adults, this gene is turned off, never to be turned on again. And if it is turned on, it's only turned on very, very briefly for short periods of time to fix certain types of damages. So the important take home message from this is that if you have a drug that targets the ALK mutation and you have an ALK overexpression or mutation, then that's not supposed to happen. So if you see overexpression of this ALK gene in a human adult, it can only be from cancer. And therefore, if you target it, it's going to be one of the driving factors of a cancer cell. And more importantly, um, it's not going to affect anything else in your body. So because of that, ALK uh, drugs that target ALK mutations don't have very many side effects because there's nothing else for them to target. They only target the, the cancer cells. So it's an important consideration. So there's numerous drugs right now that target ALK, uh, crizotinib, serotinib, electinib, brigatinib, loratinib, uh, ensartinib, entrectinib. These are all FDA approved for different types of cancers, but they can be very effective in ALK positive uh, lung cancers. However, right now, doctors typically only look for ALK fusions. But the important thing is a fusion results in overexpression of, of ALK. A mutation in ALK results in overexpression. So the important thing is you don't have to necessarily have a fusion gene or a mutation. The important take home message is if you use a diagnostic test that looks at overexpression, it doesn't matter what causes it. You know you have overexpression of ALK and therefore one of these drugs will be very beneficial for you. Thank you for watching Seatome TV. Subscribe below and stay informed.